Now, speaking of the aunties, y'all, speaking of the aunties, okay, we got to talk about it, man. Auntie podcast uh, is given, is given, is given, okay? And the episodes just keep going up and up because they keep up in the ante when it comes to these um, guests, okay? They got somebody named A.B. Antonio Brown, okay, who is a whole fool, y'all. All right. This dude is hilarious. OK, so, yes, he was recently on the auntie podcast. Right. And he's been having a lot to say. OK, um, Carlissa says y'all better put these condoms on in 2024. You shouldn't be out here fornicating at all. Oh, my. Uh, and Carlissa talking about it. And she and Carlissa, the last and it, it, last person to be talking about fornicating when you you was hooking up with Papa Blue while you was five months pregnant with Callie. All right. You got three ex-husbands and three baby daddies. Okay. I, I, I don't I don't think you should be preaching anything about fornicating. But anyways, apparently uh Antonio Brown out here tomorrow, he don't use um he don't use condoms. That's scary, y'all. Come on, man. We got to do better, man. All right. Actual discipline is a real thing. Okay. Ain't nothing wrong with wearing a condom. All right. All right. Safe S is great S. Okay. All right. Ain't nothing wrong with a latex. Okay. It'll save your life in, in many different ways. Okay. Having babies by the wrong person. Okay, catching some, all type of stuff. And honestly, man, there's nothing wrong with being celibate. Y'all know I'm team celibate. I'm all about D-discipline over here, right? All right, girls control your P, dudes control your D. Especially nowadays, because they got stuff that's uncurable. All right? But yeah, Antonio Brown is crazy, y'all. Let's check this out. Fair use. Watch yourself closely when it comes to a grown-ass woman, boy. Mm. For you, I'm going to slam my shit in the dough. Let me my shit gonna swell up. Listen, what you get a bit, you get swell B. Shit is okay. that? What type of freaky stuff you into, bro? Chill. No, chill for what? Who is this nigga? <laughs> you about to slam your meat in the door? What type of freaky? What? You yeah, he's mentally fucked. Slam his dick in the door and then fuck you. Don't. I like shoot himself in the knee. That sounds crazy. Well, I guess he's trying to say that he won't. He won't give it to her. He won't give her no uh no D. He'll rather slam his D in the dough. Huh? I'm I, I'm genuinely confused, y'all. I'm genuinely confused. Auntie, let's tell him the truth. You do got to put these condoms on. I, I feel like if I hit you with a condom, I ain't hit you. Oh, so he don't wear... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Flag on the play. I'm damn near a virgin then. I'm damn near a virgin then, if that's, if that's the case. That's crazy. I feel like if I have... If I use the condom, I didn't hit? What type of logic is that? Are we serious? It'll be 12, 2015. Yes. Okay. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way for you, uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. Condoms? You missed that Just part? make sure you got a test. But you... He got to come back. I'm hearing you, Bill. No, you're not. You're not was, touching it. I'm hearing you how I was born. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. After just saying all of that stuff about slamming your meat, now you a smash Tokyo Tony Raw? Wait. Well, that's all he do, right? He don't wear a cunt. Well, I'm just... This is scary, y'all. This is why these dudes be having all these damn babies and everybody just be swapping these uh, STIs, man. Come on, man. Got- 
Watch yourself closely when it comes to a grown ass woman, boy. Mm. For you, I'm gonna slam my shit in the dough. Let me my shit gonna swell up. Listen, what you the get fuck bit, you get swell beef. Okay. She gets swell beef. He's mentally fucked. Slam his gotta, dick in the dough and then gotta, fuck gotta, you, don't. Oh, oh, like she'll shoot herself in the knee. Hold on, Auntie. And, Let's tell him the truth. You do gotta put these condoms on. I, I feel like if I hit you with a condom, I ain't hit you. What? Yeah. Let, let's be honest, y'all. Antonio Brown slow. But let me remind y'all, bro. When school was over, when high school was done, they just freed all the special ed kids out into the world, didn't tell us who was who or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Our whole lives in school, we were separated. We knew who were who. We knew, all right, they get the tripping, don't even pay them no mind, they special ed. You know what I'm saying? After high school, they let them out into society, and we don't know, bro. So when somebody trying, you just remember, they probably them. That's probably them right there, bro. Oh, my God. What are we doing here? What's going on? Oh, so he don't wear condoms? You missed that Just part? make sure you got a test. But we, you... He got to come back. I'm hearing you, Bill. No, you not. How you're not was, touching it. I'm hearing you how I was born. What the fuck is <laughs> I'm hitting you how I was born. That's crazy. I never, I never heard of that term before. All right, yeah, he into some weird fetish. Yeah, man. Uh, you said Tokyo still act like she on the blade. Y'all crazy. Yeah, yeah. Run. Run. Man, what the hell? But it didn't stop there, y'all. Apparently, y'all know Antonio Brown is beefing with the baddies. I bet y'all didn't know that. Y'all, Antonio Brown... Um, it's enemy number one when it comes to the baddies. All right. I bet y'all didn't even know that. We're not even including this baby mama. All right. Let's include his baby mama too. Let's talk about Nunu. But look, he got a uh, beef with Biggie. Okay. He got beef with Biggie, y'all. All right. Says Antonio Brown speaks out about his comments he made towards Biggie. Okay. Fair use. Viral news. Why did you go? Why did you go Yeah, we love Biggie. Why oh, you? Now we got, uh, what is Biggie? Why you Biggie call Biggie is, like that? Who is Biggie? Biggie? The girl you said looked like a fullback or a halfback. Oh, he, <laughs> <laughs> who is Biggie? Girl, you said she looked like a fullback, a, a big back. I mean, are we lying? Like, come on, let's stop lying. Like, we ain't gonna lie to ourselves, right? Biggie is clearly a big back. Right, so him saying anything like that, like I mean, like what, what are we doing here? Like, like what, what are we doing here? And obviously, he's just talking, like he's on, she's, she's on social media and all that stuff. Like, I, I don't get it. All these people are subject to be ridiculed. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's be honest. Biggie is only known for being big and loud with that deep ass voice. All right, that woman is huge. All right. She could definitely play nose tackle right now for the Houston Texans, okay? And and, and get she if she plays seventeen games, she, she can get five six sacks. She can get five or six sacks. Let's be honest here, y'all. Big Biggie's a big person, all right. Her name is Biggie. Why are we on? Like, bro, what's going on here? Oh, so much was like Cassie, Casey Hamilton. Her back Hamilton. is big. I brought some entertainment to her. She got some press. Oh, so that was so when y'all doing it. Was that, just, he said she looked like Casey Hamilton. Who is Casey Hamilton, y'all? Let me see. Who is Casey Hamilton? I don't know who that is. Is Casey Hamilton this 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 guy? Who's Casey Hamilton, y'all? Oh, he got two. He got seven million followers on on TikTok. Oh, that's crazy. She trying to say he look he, he look like this clear man. This can't be the same person, right? All right. 
Biggie got her name honestly. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, so why are we over here? Like, that's you know what I'm saying? Why are you calling notorious big B I G big? Well, why are y'all calling big pun? Well, why did y'all call him Fat Joe? Well, like what, what are, we, are, are we playing stupid here? You know? Her name is literally Biggie, and they talking about why you calling her big. Like, we can't make this stuff up. What are we doing here? All right. Oh, you said she looked like a pill capsule. That's hilarious. That's who she looked like. Y'all know the pill capsule from um Osmosis Jones? Y'all know y'all know I'm the movie guy, y'all. Hold on. Oz Moses Jones Pill. This is Biggie, y'all. You out of pocket for saying the pill capsule. Yes. Remember the pill capsule from uh Osmosis Jones with Chris Rock and Bill Murray? Yeah, this Biggie, y'all. All right, this is Biggie. So to 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 say to, to to say that um to say uh she looked like a pill capsule is crazy. Uh I'm the big Dominican. I'm the big Dominican. Yeah, yeah, you you are, you sure are. All right. You said former stiller? No, he's so slow. He mean um her his his name not Casey Hamilton. It's um uh, it's Hayward. Hold on. Hold on. This who we talking about. Nah, it's not Hamilton, y'all. Hold on. He talking about Cameron Hayward. That's funny. Is he talking about uh C Cameron Hayward? If you talking about uh, the Steelers, former Steeler, or or did he used to play for the Steelers? Come on, man. I told you she can get about five or six sacks right now. I'm the big Dominican. All right, perfect. Now get your big ass over here on the side of this um on the, on, on the edge of this um defensive line, and let's cause some damage. We bringing back the steel curtain, boo boo. All right. Okay, we need to win this game. All right, he said no, Casey Hampton. All right, let me look him up. Let me look him up. Casey, ha Casey Hampton, Steelers. Oh, oh, bro. Put a helicopter in the chat. Oh, man. Bruh. <laughs> Bitch. I hate the internet, bruh. He said, this is Biggie, y'all. Oh, my God. I told y'all. I told y'all, you said you a Steelers girl. Okay, yeah, you letting me know. I, I kind of remember this guy. Man. Oh, I'm so done, bro. He said this is the big Dominican. Oh, my God. He, he was kind of on point. He said she looked like Casey Hampton. So why they trying to make it seem like it's like, come on. It's a human, ain't nothing bad. She's a good-looking girl. She's getting she really paid, is. right? Okay, good. So why would you hurt her feelings? Because I feel like he be like she was, it wasn't hurting her feelings. It just how was it hurting her feelings? She okay with being called Biggie? Like, bruh, we are we not? Come on, man. Come on, man. Somebody named that's literally Biggie. Feelings was hurt. Cause he said that she was big and she looked like this big ass football player. We we go act dumb. We we go act like she don't got the big back. Like she's literally the definition of a big back. All right. She has the back of Donkey Kong, y'all. Hold on, Donkey Kong back. All right. Uh, 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 are, 
Are we not doing that? Come on, man. Come on, man. She big back. And I'm saying the shoulders. She got the shoulders, bruh. Of Donkey Kong. I would not want this woman to hit me. Bruh, one punch and you are out. Okay? One punch and you're out. Okay? Hell nah. I'm cool. I'm the big Dominican. I'm the big Dominican. All right. Okay. And then it's crazy because she got the nerve to be like top heavy. You feel me? With them skinny legs. Like Crash Bandicoot. Y'all remember the game Crash Bandicoot? Hold on. Y'all remember Crash Bandicoot? Crash. So Crash Bandicoot was top, was top heavy, right? But he had them skinny legs. All right. You see, it's all shoulders. Biggie ain't got no neck, and she got all shoulders. She's all neck and shoulders. Hey, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees and toes. Hey, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Okay. You said you work out, you'll be fine. Right. 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 If Roly just work out, she'll just be a tall, you know what I'm saying? A tall, cool looking little uh Dominican chip. But she don't care. She she'll rather, she'll rather be a big back, big back, big back, big back. You know? She has a son. Oh my lord. Ah, <sighs> of course she do. Of course you do. I'm done, man. I I I I just I huh. I don't think her feelings was hurt. I think they just over here causing drama, being messy. There's no way a chick named um a chick named Biggie is being mad that people are calling her big. All right. You said we just gonna call her Nicholas this. Oh my god, no. Uh Biggie should be on the young and the necklace. Okay. All right. Y'all talking about the young and the restless? Nah. All right. She should be on the young and the necklace. Grape did Anna and AB date while her and Nunu beefing. Man, that's that's what people trying to say. I'm telling y'all, it's A B Antonio Brown versus the baddies. Okay. Thank you so much for the super chat. You are appreciated. Money. Damn. Okay, but what's his name? Oh, Antonio Brown. I need money. All right. Entertainment. She went back and forth. It was funny. So, so would you say that about a white girl too? I joke all girls, white girls, black girls. I ain't heard none of the white girls. I tell you, you ain't no white girl. Cause you don't pay attention to him. Everybody gets the smoke. The same y'all was just talking about Kaya, right? If y'all follow Antonio Brown, he literally talks about everyone: white, white, black, woman, man, a uh, zesty, hetero. He don't care. So y'all gaslighting him. I really don't like what y'all doing right now. Y'all are, y'all are gaslighting him. All right. Just say y'all don't want him to talk about Biggie, which is weird to me, because like I said, that's like what? Her name is Biggie. What are we doing here? Come on, man. Viral news. Why did he go? Why did you theaters. go Biggie? Yeah, we love Biggie. Why now you, we got, uh, what is Biggie? Why you Biggie call Biggie is, like that? Who is Biggie? Is Biggie? The girl you said looked like a fullback or a halfback. Oh, he comes so much with that Cassie. Casey Hamilton. Her back Hamilton. is big. I brought some entertainment to her. She got some press. Oh, so that was so when y'all doing it was that, just sister human. It ain't nothing bad. She's a good looking girl. She's getting she really paid, is. right? Okay, good. So why would you hurt her feelings? Because I feel like he I be feel like she was, it wasn't hurt no feeling. It just entertainment. She went back and forth. It was funny. So, so would you say that about a white girl too? I joke all girls, white girls, black girls. I ain't you heard none of the white me, girl jokes. You hear no white girl jokes? Viral news. Why did he go? Why did you go? Yeah, we. Uh, I guess this is the tweet right here. He said, what is AB's uh, baby mama doing on a TV show with Casey Ham Hampton, man? And remember, K 
Casey Hampton is the dude from the Steelers, bruh. That's crazy. Man. He not lying. He not lying. Man, this is the big Dominican. All right? The big Dominican. All right? So, um, we going to keep the beef going, y'all. All right? He got a problem with Nunu. Keep speaking on his name on baddies. So, it's not just Biggie, y'all. Let's add Nunu, his own baby mama in the mix, okay? All right? Let's go. White pussy. But then you got the ghetto girl named Nunu. And Shamika. Them. Shamika. Yeah. What's going on with you? Oh, he smiled on Shamika. Tell us about Shamika. No, I want to hear about the, the white. Hood. You got white. Them white the first baby mamas yeah. from the hood. Huh? Yeah, them the first one. <laughs> you want to talk about these baby mamas. He's a jealous type. You think I'm jealous? Yes, I think you were slightly jealous of Shamika. No, I wanted her to get an opportunity, but I didn't want her to just drop my name for the opportunity. Why not? What I got to do is, I know I'm, I'm like the new... Because this is what happens. When what? you're in the game, you drop names. You drop names when you did this. So that, Everybody has to have a name drop. So she just lists me because I'm like the new baddie or what? No, because you're her baby daddy. Oh my God, man. Uh, so look, this is funny, man. Look what's been happening. So he beefing or going back and forth with his baby mama, Nunu, right? Then he got problems with Biggie, right? Now he got problems with Anna Mac, y'all. All right, because Anna Mac was talking trash about him, right? Right? Somebody says, so did Anna uh sleep with Nunu's baby daddy? Right? AB says. Blow job better than no job. Uh oh. Uh oh. The fuck busy. That same baby daddy who sucking. Who you you swear you hurt my feelings by? He not gonna be there to help you. The fuck busy. That same baby daddy who sucking. Who you you swear you hurt my feelings by? He not gonna be there to help you. The fuck busy. That same baby daddy who. Sucking, who you, you swear oh whoa 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 now i don't know if she would like why would she even say that why would she say that y'all is, is they trying to say anna mac and ab was smashing it wouldn't surprise us y'all all of these people be sharing the same the same ding dongs and cootie cats right so like is this really surprising if this is true right i don't think so Okay, so check this out. It says, Anna Mac lets it be known she never did anything with Antonio Brown despite his recent retweet. Okay, um, so AB says, Blowjob is better than no job. She says, B, I never met you in my life. I told you this CTE is crazy. You and your baby mother both effing slow. Nah, what, please? <laughs> she says, A.B., go get your CTE checked. You broke, bankrupt, remedial. Jeez. Tell me how you really feel. Trash music, wannabe, Kanye fried, ASS, better go head playing with me. You and your broke baby mama, Nunu, ain't so bright for real. I feel bad for y'all, son. Why you gotta, why you gotta bring the babies into it, though? I was with you until you brought up the babies, Anna. Come on, man. You are a goofy no, bitch. No, that's not true. Come on, man. You literally, like, I was totally with you until you brought up the babies. The babies have nothing to do with this. The 12, 2015. Yes. Okay. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way for you, uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit Come on, man. We got to do better than that. But Anna don't care. Uh, she also says, uh, LMAO, babe, I ain't effing with that man. I don't even know you never met him in my real life. I think she was saying metaphorically because I brought him up 
But like, why can't I bring him up if she always bring him up? Right? That's a good point. Like they played a whole montage, y'all. She brought up uh she brought up um Antonio Brown a thousand times, y'all, on the show. All right. Let me see if I can find that clip real quick. She brought that man up so many times on the show. It's like, dang, girl, we get it. He's your baby daddy. We get it, girl. Okay. Uh, you know, happy for you, you know, but dang. Come on, man. You know she has something to say. You know she has something to say. Look, hold on. They got to bring up this dude being her baby daddy. All right? Because that's her claim to fame. All right? She's better off being on uh, Basketball Wives. Do, 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 do the baddies care if you got a baby by a baller or something like that? I don't, I don't think that's a prerequisite for the baddies. Very controversial, very successful, Antonio Brown. And the baby mom to one of the professional football players, Antonio Brown. Hey, hold on. Hurry, say, look at my baby daddy, y'all. My baby daddy. Eyes, Antonio Brown, baby mother. You can't even keep your baby about. father. What? No. Be no, your bitch, baby I'm father. Here because I'm here. Like you said, I'm Antonio yes, Brown, I'm baby home. mother. Okay, We're just, just leaving. One last thing, Anna, make sure you call my baby daddy. We can see the only thing that matters is what the family is going to have. Okay, guys, okay. come on, let's go. Hello, Antonio Brown. I don't want your baby father, baby daddy. Mm. And that's on my baby's ass. I'm going to beat your ass, and that's on my baby's dad. <laughs> that same baby daddy. No, you you talking about my baby daddy? I'm talking about my baby daddy. Eyes, Antonio Brown, baby mother. They are very controversial. Very. I'm Antonio Brown's baby mother, right? So she like, damn. Uh, you bring him up so much. Why can't Why can't I bring him up? You know. You know. These people is crazy, y'all. So yeah, um, <laughs> Antonio Brown uh, got problems with his own baby mama, Nunu, uh, Biggie, and Anna Mac. Okay, crazy. And then I feel like Nunu is like the hottest one right now, huh? Everybody got a problem with her. Nobody liked that girl. Nobody liked that girl to the point that Diamond even got something to say. Okay, DTB. Has something to uh, say about Nunu too. All right. So I know if she's annoying to the girls, I can only imagine being her baby daddy. Oh my Lord. That's why Antonio Brown said, man, stop speaking on me. Okay. So this message is for no, no. Okay. You want to be Carisha, please look and reject that. You want to be young Miami so bad. You got left off bad and bougie want to be a uh, young Miami bitch this is not that all right you you think you a city girl you want to be a city girl but you're not a city girl let's start there um you gonna sit here and try to act like <clears throat> you did your big one you did your big one baby you did not do no big one you did a very minor one all right let's let's you you snuck me that's the only reason I was on the floor and really and truly it wasn't because you hit me like I was just being dramatic I was being extra as fuck you hit me I was like ah! like just being funny everybody was there knew that was a funny moment i was laughing the whole time you didn't do nothing let's start there okay and then you have the nerve to act like oh for crash out you're this you're that like oh you taking up fights for other people like first of all didn't you jump into this whole argument with anna for somebody else okay so this message is for no no okay for something that had absolutely nothing to do with you at least anna's my friend i'm fighting for my home girl or somebody i know to my but you don't all right i'm right don't with you you don't give a about you so you inserted yourself in a situation that had absolutely nothing to do with you but then want to talk about me coming into a situation that i ain't had nothing to do with no baby that have something to do with me that's my homie so guess what <laughs> tag i'm it you want to fight her you want to fight me you how about that Carisha, please, like, no, or something that had absolutely nothing to do with you. At least, I didn't fight for uh, honor because I ain't no funky. That was a funky move. You got y'all gotta know this stuff. How are y'all the viewers? I you ain't fight for uh, honor because I ain't no funky. That was a funky move. You got y'all gotta know this stuff. How are y'all the viewers? I you ain't fight for.
So it says Nunu feels like Diamond the Body is a crash out and says she didn't come and reinforce anything. So Nunu says Diamond was a crash out. Like I keep saying they thought she was a reinforcement, but don't enforce anything. Okay. All right. Uh, and y'all know Tashiki uh, had to speak on this whole situation because everybody want her to fight uh, everybody battles. Okay. She the one that's not, she's the one on baddies, right? But not fighting. What's the whole point of even being on baddies if you're not going to be a baddie? That's what they do on there. They ratchet. All right. They ratchet. Okay. Come on, man. Y'all know that. And they all beefing, y'all. None of these people like each other. I thought they was friends, man. So apparently Callie, y'all know Blueface's sister, Carlissa's daughter, Callie Way, right? Callie is on the baddies too, right? Apparently, she got an issue with Anna Matt, right? They going back and forth, exposing each other text messages and stuff, right? So, it says, Callie shares a screenshot of a DM between her and Anna Matt, okay? Okay? And, it's, and it shows that, it shows that Callie Way um, is following Diamond, but not following Anna Matt, all right? Um, I can't, I can barely read this because they blocking everything. She says, blah, 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 Gretchen never intended to you. I never intended to beef with you either way. I don't have nothing to say about you. The real you is honestly a sweetheart. Oh, I guess this is Anna Mac texting Callie. She's saying, so I'll apologize on that. Cause again, that situation was, was, and is touchy. If I would have known sooner, I would have been reached out, to be honest. Callie says, if you're going to call me a flip-flop or don't or don't start flip-flopping now, I'm open to having a conversation with you at the reunion. This group chat is corny to me. Sorry. Oh, yeah, because I guess she was saying she was a flip-flopper because Callie didn't hop in when um, Anna Mac fought Ma uh, Mariah Lynn's mom and auntie. Callie Way was there. And I guess, you know, she wanted Callie to jump in. Y'all, these people are so messy. It says, it's the let me tap in before the reunion. If you want to dog my name in public, I'm going to need you to apologize in public. Oh, my God. So, Callie uh, taking shots at Anna Mac, y'all. Okay. So, yeah, uh, this is great promotion for the reunion. Everybody fighting, y'all. So we looking forward to Tashiki fighting uh Diamond, right? Uh Diamond wanna fight Natalie. Okay, and apparently I guess Callie about to fight on a mat. Okay, and so, so many more, right? Ro what Roly and ET? These people was crazy, y'all. And Tashiki know that everybody wanna fight her, but she trying to say it's because uh they know it's for a storyline and it's for clout. Which which uh it, it could definitely be true. It could definitely be true. Uh, remember, I think Nunu said that. Nunu, remember we did the live when they was exposing uh, Zeus? It was Smiley, Nunu, uh, Anna Mac. Um, I forgot, uh, DJ Sky. It was a lot of people talking, right? Um, and they were saying that, um, you know, the, the producers and certain people on the set be telling them, be being messy, be lying, you know, doing all type of stuff so you can feel some type of way so you can fight somebody. You know what I'm saying? Um, so Tashiki says, look, it says Tashiki feels like people like to beef with her because it's beneficial for them. All right. Um, it's she says exactly. I feel wait, I just feel like people beef with me because it's beneficial and I just be chilling. And she tagged them. She tagged Zeus Network. It says Tashiki, Diamond the Body. Tashiki was cheering you both on. So what's really the issue? No shade. Uh oh. Right. She's not trying to get into none of this stuff, which is, like I said, it's still counterproductive because why are you on baddies trying to be the good Samaritan? Why are you on, um, why are you on baddies trying to have, uh, morals? You know, it, it, it doesn't go together. All right. Baddies is full of degenerates. You have to be a degenerate. Okay. You have to be a degenerate. Okay. This is crazy, man. This is crazy. So y'all know, dude. Um, I, I think it's true though. I think it's true. 
I think it's true. Tashiki, they know that she's a fighter, right? They know that she really get down. She did her big one on the last season and all that stuff, right? So people are expecting to see that, right? So when they don't see it, they're like, girl, why are you even here? You know what I'm saying? I'm not fighting nobody. I'm not in it. They're going to have to pay me more. Well, I don't think she's going to be on the next season. She could be just because, but I just, I, I don't see like why. Like, why would she be there, y'all? It's not like she has like uh, this infectious uh, personality. She just doesn't, you know? Um, what draws her is obviously that she's Christian's sister and that she eats. She fights. She'll knock you out, right? So I think if she don't redeem herself on the reunion, beating up um, um, Diamond and probably somebody else, I don't know. I just don't see her on Baddies Midwest. Why? They need to replace her with Ivory. Ivory go fight any and everybody. Man or woman. Ivory crazy. Okay? So, um, apparently they was all on a live together recently, right? Man, and this dude hopped on the live, y'all, with Tashiki and uh, Anna Mac. And remember this dude, Funyan or Fusion or something? Remember? I think he's he got to be associated with Zeus. He's always having, like, the, the baddies and stuff on his uh, lives, and he's talking to them and stuff. Um, man, he started reading them, y'all. Check this out. This is the same dude that had that wig on. Remember, we was doing the live and he had the, the wig on, and y'all was uh dragging him. Let's go, fair use. Boy, you ugly as shit. Your mouth greasy as shit. Your eyes, eyeballs big as fuck. Your nose wide as shit. You look like a messy ass motherfucking overzealous duck. You're ugly as shit. You messy as shit. You always. And what the fuck type of name is Fu Yang anyway? Bitch, you sound like your name sound like a Chinese cuisine. What the fuck is that? Right. Let me get some Fu Yang, Fu Yang with a chicken Fu Yang. This right. is a mess. And you always going to you always going to come in this motherfucker <laughs> trying to cut jokes. Bitch, if I wanted to, if I wanted to hear a joke, I would pick up the phone and call your mother, motherfucker. Fuck is you talking about? And don't even think about opening your motherfucking mouth because until I unzip in my pants, there's no reason your mouth should be open. Little boy, little boy, so I'm going to fuck you up. And I'm gonna, I am going to let you know. Okay, please. So make sure you ready. Please. Yeah. I am. I am. And I'm telling you, you walk in my hood, you're not walking out. Oh. <laughs> Where am I, dad? Why you, why, please, you look a shriveled up black wood, you black bitch. Get the fuck off the live. Hey, that's not cuss. That's not cuss. You shriveled up black and mild. Oh, let me no not cuss. See you guys. This is all right. laughs and jokes. We just joke. You like a cigarette, boy. Get out of here. Okay, well, can I tell y'all? Cigarettes. You cigarette smoking. Get out of here. What's up? Yeah. Boy, you ugly as shit. Your mouth greasy as shit. Your eyes, eyeballs big as fuck. Your nose wide as shit. You look like a messy yeah. ass motherfucking overzealous duck. You're ugly as shit. You messy as shit. You always. And what the fuck type of name is Boo Yang anyway? <laughs> Bitch, you sound like your name sound like a Chinese cuisine. What the fuck is that? Right. Let me get some Boo Yang, Boo Yang with a chicken Boo Yang. Right. He even knew that was funny. That's why he started smiling. <laughs> <laughs> a mess and you always, always going to you always going to come in this motherfucker trying to clock jokes bitch if i wanted to if i want to hear a joke i will pick up the phone and call your mother motherfucker fuck are you talking about and don't even think about opening your motherfucking mouth because until i unzip in my pants there's no reason your mouth should be open little boy little boy so i'm gonna fuck you up and i'm gonna i am gonna let you know okay please so make sure you ready please yeah. i am i am I'm telling you, walk in my hood, you're not walking out. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The zest, the zesties is fighting y'all. The zesties is fighting y'all. I saw this. I said, oh yeah, that's that's crazy. That's crazy because it was funny how he be maneuvering all of this beef and stuff because he be having all the baddies and Zeus people on there, but they never really say nothing to him. So I I just found it interesting that somebody finally brought some energy to him. You know what I'm saying? He's like, man, you messy as hell, bro. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like she talks. And sped and chopped it. No, that was a dude. That was a dude talking. <laughs> it was Battle of the Zesties. Yeah. Yeah, crazy, right? Crazy, man. Crazy. Um, But yeah, man, these people was crazy, y'all, man. The, the baddies is baddying. The baddies is baddying, okay? They always fighting at this point. The baddies is fighting. Um, Nothing new. Nothing is new. Y'all know I'm going to keep y'all updated with uh, the latest tea. We looking forward to that uh, Baddies Caribbean uh, reunion coming up soon. You feel me?